There are many reasons why someone might want to export logs. Maybe you are an old hat like me and just prefer to manipulate logs from a simple text file. Maybe you want to import the logs into a different program, or use a custom Python log aggregator. Whatever the reason, we will show you how to export your logs to a file using Journal CTL. If you are new to Journal CTL, I recommend first reading our primer titled Viewing Logs with Journal CTL. I will leave a link in the description. It contains a bunch of great information that can also be used when exporting logs to a file. Let's get started. Don't forget to subscribe to our channel and hit the bell icon to be notified of new videos. If you want to just dump all the logs, you can do a simple redirection. If you are unfamiliar with the concept of redirection read our primer titled, I.O., Standard Streams, and Redirection. Check the description for a link. To export all logs from journal CTL into a file, simply use the greater than sign to redirect the output into a file like so. Now that you have all the logs in a text file, you can manipulate that file any way you like. However, be prepared for a rather large text file. That much raw data in a single text file is daunting. Let's take a look at how we can refine this output. In our viewing logs with journal CTL primer we show you how to refine your searches with journal CTL. You can use any of those options, or a combination of those options to export only the logs you want. For example let's say we wanted to find all the network manager logs since yesterday. We can use the minus U option to specify the unit and the minus capital S option to specify a start time. Here we are specifying we want the logs from the network manager service unit since yesterday. Again we are using simple redirection to export the logs into the network manager logs since yesterday.txt file. Not the most graceful name, I know. Journal CTL offers many ways to format the journal entries to fit your needs. For example, you can export all the logs into JSON format. You can also use the short option which provides classic syslog style logs, one line per entry. Let's take a look at these examples. To format journal entries as JSON objects we will use the minus O option to specify JSON. Again we will use redirection to export it to the network manager dash JSON file. We can then use this file to import this data into other applications that use JSON formatting. Here is an example of formatting the journal entries into a classic syslog style log file and exporting it to the network manager.log file. That's it. You now know how to export journal CTL logs to a file. You can find all the options that can be used in the journal CTL man page. We hope you found this Linux quick tip useful. If you did, please subscribe to our channel and click the bell icon to be notified of new videos. A link to all the referenced articles will be provided in the description.